Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell the solution of 8th problem from exercise 13.3 from NCRT from surface areas and volumes class 10. Water in a canal 6 meters wide and 1.5 meters deep is flowing with a speed of 10 km per hour. How much area will it irrigate in 30 minutes if 8 centimeters of standing water is needed? So here the water in this canal uh, with of this canal is uh, 6 meters and height is 1.5 meters and right here width of the canal B is equal to 6 meters and height of the canal H is equal to 1.5 meters and speed of this water is um, 10 kilometer per hour and here we have to find how much area will it irrigate in 30 minutes if 8 centimeters this is 8 centimeters of standing water is needed. So here speed of the water in the canal is 10 km per hour. That means in one hour, the water flow is in 10 km. Length of that water is 10 km. Therefore, length of the water flow in one hour is equal to 10 km. All are in meters. So you have to convert this kilometer into meters. One kilometer is 1000 meters. So 10 into 1000, that is 10,000 meters. So length of the water flow in one hour is 10,000 meters. Therefore, volume of the water flow in one hour is equal to LBH because this canal is in the shape of a cuboid. So, volume is LBH. So, here length is L is 10,000 meters and B is uh, 6 meters and H is 1.5 meters. Therefore, that is equal to 10,000 into 6 into 1.5. This is 1.5 meter cube. And this is in one hour, that means 60 minutes. But here we have to find in 30 minutes. So in 60 minutes, the volume of the water flow is this one. So volume of the water flow in 30 minutes is equal to 10,000 into 6 into 1.5 into 30 by 60. So 30 ones are 32, sir, 60. Then 2 ones are 2, 3, sir, 6. If you multiply this 3 into 1.5, that is 4.5 into 10,000 meter cube. This is volume of the water flow in 30 minutes from the canal. And uh, here height of the standing water is given here. So that is H1 is equal to 8 centimeters. If you convert this in meters, 8 by 100, that is 0 0.08 meters. And in 30 minutes, volume of the standing water in the irrigation field is equal to volume of the water flow from this canal. So volume of the standing water, this is also in the shape of a cuboid. So that is LBH. So LB here we have to find the area to be irrigated. So area into H1 because you have to find area. So area into H1 is equal to here area is L here LB in this field, in this irrigation field LB. So area into H1 is equal to LBH. LBH is for this canal. So area is equal to LBH by H1 that is equal to 4.5 here LBH is see here 4.5 into 10,000. So 4.5 into 10,000 by H1 is 0 0.08. This is the irrigation field, the standing water in this irrigation field. So 0 0.08. So if you calculate this, you will get 56, 5,62,500 meters square. If you convert this into hectares, uh, one, uh, one hectare is 10,000 meters square. So if you divide this with 10,000, then you will get 56.25 hectares. Therefore, area irrigated is 56.25 hectares. Now, please do this question, similar question. 